day guys welcome back to the channel so i'm gonna do a little update of what i found out about since the release of last hope on earth back in november of 2020 um there's been a lot of changes and everything to the game so here we go so it's basically one guy gabriel is a one-man team more or less about developing this game so i was on steam one day and was going through the game i came across this and a little to say here's their trailer That's what it got me wanted to play the game. So I did a little research on YouTube, didn't find too much about the gameplay, but I came across one content creator. So when they first started, they had a town that they spawned in, naked, normal, okay, but it had a twist, it had the zombies that spoke two words from what I gathered from his video. Brains and zombies. So they would go and, you know, two tap you, most likely. That's what I gathered. So I downloaded the game. This is my gameplay. No town in sight, just big ass buildings. That was in zones. So this one here I found in zone C4. There was a grid system on top, it navigated it around. I got two videos up on that on that gameplay so this is what the update had provided us it's bigger and better more more content more one they want to focus more on pvp so okay cool so you know early development it's going to have its issues it's not it's not fully done yet which is what you should expect when it's in beta. Now, they did finally add a map, which I was very happy about because, you know, I like maps. And then, you know, they added a new way to survive challenge. Some guns. A new enemy. Looks pretty dope. That guy. Another cool design. And when they release it in November 2020, I guess that's back when they had the house designs and all of that. But 2021, this latest update, it all changed. So, in update 1, there was new animals, new weapons. They finished the wiki and did a tutorial for it. So, in the update 2, they added new monsters, new zones, finished the HUD. And added a new boss. Three. Tech. Mode. All of that. New languages. New bosses. New clothes. All of that. So here's a little bit of the gameplay. That I did for the new version. Gives you some information about it. Reminding you that it is a one guy 
team that's basically developing this game system. So I'm really hoping that this game gets what it deserves. Just like any game, a chance. So I did. So when we're looking through here, there was a little lag in between the start. I was like, what the hell? But okay. So we spawn in near crash airplane. Okay. Normal, I guess it will be. So when you spawn in, there's hardly any trees as you can tell. Okay. Yeah. Here's the map. This is where we are right here on the map. And then these little question marks right here is where the boss fights are. This is where you go. But this is all you spawn in with. Just basically nothing but an axe. So as usual, what you got to do, you got to do some grinding to get some of your stuff. Normal. Okay. Let's speed it up here for a few seconds and get to where we're going because this guy is slow. He's so slow. <laughs> So, when you're chopping a tree, you get your normal fiber, you would, but you do get an apple and some berries. The berries is good for taming animals. You can tame a deer and a pig and everything. So, this is the closest boss that we're going to go to, check out the area and see what's there. So, power editing, let's go. I'm going to run to that bad boy. So again, this is where we're going to go. This is the closest one to me. I don't feel like running into the snow area because one, I ain't got no clothes. So, we're going to head over there. Getting closer. A little closer. Okay, so I'm going to decide to hit some more on the street to get some more food an apple. So, as you can tell, we can, we're getting closer and closer to it. So, when you come up across it, that blue thing right there, that's where you spawn in the, uh, one of the bosses. But, unfortunately, ooh, okay, we got some animals here. He killed it. I killed it. So, there's a little bag that you need to look for. Meat doesn't stack. Don't like it. So, this one here is the fat orb, org, and you need six heads in order to uh, spawn it in to fight it. I don't have it because you know, I just want to give you a little bit of gameplay for it and you know talk about the game a little bit. So as you can see there are more animals towards this uh, biodome over here. So you can you know get you some meats and stuff like that. Wouldn't suggest to build over in this area and unless you really want to when i first played it um this is my second time first time i played it i built me a, like a little building and uh something had some monster came up i didn't get a recording of that because i just wanted to test it out so the crafting you can craft all this right here on your inventory and you know it costs us a little bit more than what it had did previously to make the materials. So it gets pretty dark, pretty decent, and what the hell is that? Okay, yeah, it's a big ass ape. Yeah, okay. That's nice. And all I have is next. I heard something running because it's probably scared as hell just like I am. I'm trying to get it behind it because the turn rate is just not all that great. Well, that's one, two hit, and three hit. Backing up, trying to get it behind it, it's not going to happen. Four hit. And I'm dead. So, there you go. You gotta have some good stuff in order to fight those bit boys in order to get their heads. Once you kill them, you do get meat, leather, in their head um, for the artifact. So, that's where my body is. It does show you where, and that is where, um, it shows you basically where you died at. Um, if you don't get to, 
uh, where you died at in time, your stuff is despawned. There is a bag. It's very hard to see. So, that's about it, you guys. Um, until there's another update, I probably won't play it again until there is a better update to it. So, I want to give it some time because, like I said, it's a one-man team. Hopefully, you can get some more people in. But who knows? There you go. Hope you enjoy the video.